Thanks for joining this quick how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe so you get notified when we drop more content. In this screencast, we're going to learn how to delete a component from a managed package from the org where the package was created. This specific screencast is for users who create packages. A managed package is a collection of application components that cannot be altered and can be installed in a Salesforce org. As opposed to an unmanaged package where the components can be altered. After you've uploaded a managed release package, you may find that a component needs to be deleted. The component may no longer be needed going forward, and these changes will occur in the customer org for a future release version of the package when they install in their org. There is a subset of components that can be deleted from a package only, such as custom buttons or links, custom console, custom fields, custom objects. There's a larger list of components that can be deleted, which is shown in the link below. We put this in the short description of this video, so you can copy and paste it easily. Most importantly, once the component is deleted, the name remains within Salesforce. You can never create another component with the exact same name. To enable this feature, the user will have to contact the AppExchange team via a support case and request for the Enable Managed Component Deletion permission. The profile must have the Create App Exchange Packages permission on their profile. Since I'm logged in, I'll go to a component I want to delete that's part of the package I have created in my org. In this case, I'll go to a custom object A and locate the binding field. Click on the Delete link next to Binding. A dialog box will appear which will show the ramifications of this change. Please make sure you read this before going through with the change. Enter yes in the text box after reading and click on the delete button. Go back to the created package and click on the view deleted components button. This will show the field that was deleted. After all the changes are made, then create a new package version. Then distribute the new version to the customer so the change will be reflected in the new org. The field that was deleted will now have the option to be deleted in the customer orgs. The customer will have the option to either keep the field and data or delete it. You'll find a link in the short description of this video to the KB article on how to delete managed components. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.